let's bring in to the discussion our trial attorneys that are standing by Michael Jaffer in Detroit and in Washington DC law enforcement and litigation expert Sonny Slaughter Michael we're gonna hear those text messages in a moment but your take on not only how the victim's mom is doing on the stand but also that moment about these text messages you know so here's here's my analysis uh, of this I feel like I feel like there's a reason why the prosecution decided not to bring this case and then they changed their mind I feel like after they decided to, to when they when they decided to bring the charges they started hearing more and more evidence now we know it's from the from the mother right uh, another side of the story to who her son was these text messages are going to be revealing and also what I'll tell the the viewers is these stand your ground hearings are not a trial that's why you, you saw the defendant testify because she's actually required to testify right in Kansas she's actually required to testify in the at the stand your ground hearing right so that's why this this looks like kind of like a TV trial it's not a real trial but it's, it's a, because it's a stand your ground hearing so the way I see the way I see it is these prosecutors started finding evidence about this incident after they decided not to bring the charges uh, and it seems to me like the, the the evidence was brought to them by by the mother uh, I think she's she's you know she's performing as best as she could she lost her son um, like my co-panelist says you know what your children are capable of she clearly is capable knows who her son who her son was but she wasn't happy losing him uh, she may have even warned him hey you need to you need to cool your jets uh, because you're going down a bad path but uh, I think uh, this is going to be telling and what these text messages show uh, are going to basically be the the, the the deciding factor on whether or not this case goes forward 